Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Guardians Crusade. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and uh, I had completely forgotten to check that one, uh, the, the church back in Garam. So I went ahead and went all the way back there to check it out, and it turns out there really wasn't much there. The source of the weird growly noise was nowhere to be seen. There was a treasure chest, but I couldn't open it. And, uh, yeah, turn, though, turns out there was a couple of equipment upgrades in the shop that I had forgotten about, too, so I went ahead and grabbed those. And along the way, I gained a couple levels, and I'm pretty darn sure I have more money now than I did then. So, let's, uh, and, yeah. unfortunately, with the levels, these Leo birds are still going to come at me. But, you know what, that's fine. That is fine. If nothing else, it means we're less likely to come across the the third stage of overworld enemy sprites, so. Although this I could doing I could do without you use spamming the stupid rage tornado. So, oh, except the enemies here are weaker. What is this if it's a theoretically weaker than the oh, right? These are from a while back, aren't they? Very odd. Very odd indeed that we're seeing enemies like this around. Ah, but they're not the only enemies here. All right, what else do we have here? Are these more Leo birds, or is this something else? It is uh, very much a something else. An octagon. Wanted to at least get one down before I started healing. Since I don't know just how bad the enemies in here are generally going to be, I'm just going to try to keep my uh, magic points topped off. I, I'll, I'll give the the fairies this much. It's the damage that fairy is doing is consistent. It's consistently low, but it's still consistent. Though I appreciate that that thing's attacks are pretty quick. I did not see how much experience that was, but that is a lot of money. All right, but one thing that the uh, the one person in the church was did tell me about was that apparently the uh, everybody else was supposed to be here. So let's see. It this was our major goal. So let's see what happens. Who's that with the red cape? Carmine, even if you succeed in unsealing Zizan, we already have the Holy Stones to seal him right back. 
give it up. Gwendolyn, use your spells to arrest him. Yes, my lord. Here are the stones you wanted, Master Carmine. I had a feeling about you. Turns out I was right. What's going on? Gwendolyn, what are you doing? Why are you handing him the stones? Good work, Gwendolyn. Or should I say, Glor. <laughs> Not even I thought you would be able to get them so easily. It was all thanks to those fools, Master. Gwendolyn, you traitor. Uh, Gwendolyn, they were, she was never on your side to begin with, it looks like. You were, you were fooled. Ramal, what's going on? I don't understand. You poor, pathetic creatures. Gwendolyn is my servant, Glor. I should thank you, of course. You brought me the stones faster than I could have ever found them myself. Such efficiency. Ha! Now nobody can stop me from carrying out my plans. What? We traveled all over the world for those stones because Gwendolyn said we needed them to stop Carmine's plan. Gwendolyn, you traitor, how could you? Silence. Glor, you've done an excellent job. It was my pleasure, Master. I have one more task for you. One last task. One last task, Master? Master, no. Why? Please, not that spell! But Master, I... Bye-bye, Glor. Oh, and remember, evil is what evil does. So, yeah, that's how Carmine shows his appreciation by killing his sir, killing the one who helped him. Oh, dear. Okay, um... Right. Okay, let's see how you do against this thing. Ooh, that hurts. But so do you. Death breath. Now it's just a matter of who has more health. Well, there's our answer. Lord Kalkanor! You, you had better run. It's like, now, nah, oh jeez. Oh, that's not going to help you. <laughs> but you do have more defense than Kalkanor does, which is weird. Hey, you, you need to be running away now. Love tornado. Uh, yeah, that ain't gonna help you either. Hey, at least you got one attack in. That's supposed to just healing yourself ineffectually. 
Lord Kalkanor, I... Uh... So is that your true form, or were you just transformed into that? Okay. Let's see. Hopefully you don't use if let's hope you're not using death breath too often. Okay, yeah, that that hurts a bit. Thankfully, Pyro is helping a good bit. Okay, so I, I can't target my healing on the living toy. Okay. I didn't think so. Especially since we don't see the living toy's health. But, oh well. Not that big of a deal. Now I'm starting to think that the damage that the living toy does is linked to its health, which is probably why it's being consistently high like that. And there's the death breath. And down you go. I like Pyro so much. You guys are gonna live? You must warn Tr Triskin. Tell King what happened. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Alright, so I guess we're not going into the tower yet. We're gonna go get some help for you. Hopefully no monsters come by to eat you. Oh, it's okay. It's just one. That's fine. And, nah. The difference between getting healed for a third versus getting healed for half is not worth the the extra cost. I got stuck on the tree. Opportunity to I was probably gonna I was gonna heal this turn regardless, but taking out the first uh the first one of these things definitely makes me feel better. Dang a crit for 191.
Dang, after all that, how close are we? Oh, geez, yeah, we're close to another level already. Dang. First things first, I'm gonna heal. But our blind teacher does not fear danger. We will not run. I mean, Calcanor and Ramal, they're hurt. Patience, you two worry, the two you worry about are safe. I have sent an assistant to carry them to Triskin. How, how did you know? That's not important right now. What is important is that I sense darkness all around. A bad omen come true. And now another of the holy creatures is in grave danger. Uh, tell us what's wrong. Something horrible is going to happen at God's Tower. I have to go. I have to go there right now. I don't want to put you two in danger, so I'm going by myself. Thank you for taking care of me. I'll never forget you. Baby, what are you talking about? We aren't going to let you go there alone. If anyone goes, we all go. Right? Darn right. So what are we waiting for? Let's go back to the tower. Wait. Let me give you something that might be of some use to you. Living toy Gabriel. Uh... Oh... Huh. Okay. How expensive is that? I must know. I, I must test this. And I believe this will give me another level anyway, but... Uh... Fifty. Not a bad emergency button. I hope I don't have to use it, though. <laughs> oh, levels. Yeah. Weird that the tree and that these the weak tree enemies are kind are just mixed in with everything else here. I mean, given the motif of this place and you know seeing the actual trees around, it makes some sense. But Uh, 
Uh, no, no, not. Wrong one. There we go. As long as I can keep everybody's health good with Cupid and Kimoni, everything should be fine. Should being the operative word. Uh, but since I'm usually keeping my uh, PP topped up, having the emerg having that emergency button does is, has some level of comfort. I'd, I'd be more likely to use that than Angel for sure. Okay. Yep. Sure enough, uh, Kalkanor and Ramal are gone. Now, question of the moment, what kind of enemies do we have in here? I have no idea what that is. But we got treasure. Magic and item. Miracle armor. Alright, let's see how good this stuff, this thing is. It is an improvement. Alright then. Let's see if there's armor on this side, too. Well, there's treasure, at least. Miracle sword. Boom. Okay, so the only thing we're missing is the helmet. Surprise. We always seem to be lacking in the good headgear. Uh... Well, I'm glad I went that way first. Oh, <laughs> ain't getting past that. Feels weird that I'm getting that the X, the XP gains are just going up as quickly as they are. Holy cow! Oh, it's more of you. Okay. So, 
How high does this tower go? Because it's basically one more or less required enemy encounter per floor at the moment. That your your attacks are suddenly doing breaking a hundred on a consistent basis. That is quite nice. Don't quite remember what it was before, but I thought it didn't think it was that close to triple digits. Okay, side room. Oh. Okay. Thank you. W wasn't expecting that. Firing. Powers you up against water elements. Oh dear. Hello. Anzo. I've been waiting for you. Oh, you you know baby. Program error. Program aborted. System reboot. Login. Carmine. Oh no. Carmine is my master. You shall not pass. Carmine got admin access. Yay. Pyro. Do your thing. Okay, your attack power isn't linked to your health. Oh, I think you're about to leave after this one? Yeah. Seems like they can, can regularly tank three hits before they're gone. See how well this goes. Uh, not much. You got the kill shot? Oh, that's funny. All right. <laughs> Every little bit of damage helps. OK, 
Okay, living toy, Dark Cross. Eliminates everyone's light. Um. Okay. Not entirely sure what that means. But have I have no idea what's about to happen, and I have been given the ability to heal and save right here, and I am going to take advantage of that in more ways than one. So I guess join me next time when we see what other tricks Carmine has up his sleeve, I suppose. And, you know, see what that pillar of light does, and maybe we'll find out other things. So, until then, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.